Hello, you're live with Daisy. Hello, you're live with Daisy. Hello? 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 This video is fair use. It is transformative and is protected under Section 107 of the Copyright Act 1976. Allowance is made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comment, reporting, teaching, and more. So, hi. Welcome to another video. Tonight we're going to listen to a small portion of one of Daisy's lives. It is titled, Let's Chat. And it's got Address the Lies in the thumbnail. Oh, wait, wait just a second. Daisy has something to say first. You're literally stealing my content. I mean, you're literally stealing my content. No, that was my stolen live it, that was stolen from me it was stolen you know it's hard out here for a bill yeah tastes like magic get your own damn content got to have it tastes like magic How would you feel if somebody was stealing your content? Well, Daisy, all I can really say about that is that you really need to look up the Fair Use Act. Even if you thought your content was on private, it was public. We heard it. Therefore, it's fair use. As long as people are adding commentary or transforming it, it's fair game. So have a look, read your fair use stuff, check your terms of service and here we go i'm about to use some of your content stolen content get your own damn content Got to have it. but daisy let's be honest here you like to use people's content don't you i think you do I wanted to come up here with Daisy. I, I got to hit, listen to some of that live, but only the beginning. I hadn't been able to finish it. You know how bad it was? I was like, you've no. got to be kidding me. You have to give me the rundown because I have no idea. I'll play it. I'll play some of it. They tried to take it. I'll play it. I'll play some of it. They tried. Daisy, you play people's content all the time. So it's fair game. What's yours is mine, and what's mine is yours. You feel free to play my content anytime. Fair use, okay? Go for it. Anyway, let's get to the live that we're actually reviewing. It's not that long, hopefully. I'm gonna lie to you. Demons attach themselves to things. And yes, if you have one of them wind charms in your house, you could very well be inviting demons into your home. Wind chimes. Oh, so dangerous. Well, let's see, let's see. I mean, they could be creepy, but Daisy, what the heck? I personally love wind chimes. I think Daisy must have messed up what she was saying. Whoops. Wind chimes are the best. They are very relaxing. I know not everyone loves them, but I do. Well, and these people do, and obviously there was more people that do. I just didn't catch all of them, but a lot of people love wind chimes. I'm trying to be a bit quiet because people are sleeping in my house. So sorry if I'm sounding a bit quieter than usual. All right, let's keep going or we'll never get this done. Here we go. Or people blaming God because bad things happen to them. Uh, dream catcher. Yeah, there you go. A dream catcher, yes. Oh, she meant dream catcher. She didn't mean wind chimes or charms. Whoops. Oopsie doopsie. Well, let's keep listening. God, listen, there's laws in heaven. Jesus said in the Lord's Prayer, on earth as it is in heaven. That means a lot of heaven and earth are the same. There is law in heaven like there's law on earth. 
And there is legal ways for the devil to come into your life. Okay? Legal ways that blocks God's blessings. And them are the things that you wonder why you don't get blessed. Them are the things. Oh, geez. Them are the things. Am I going to hell? I hope not. And I don't think so. Because you are letting things into your home, into your mind, into your heart that blocks those blessings or even brings death upon your family. Well, oh my goodness. I certainly hope that my dream catcher and my wind chimes are not going to cause death upon my family or cause generational curses or send me to hell. I'm pretty confident in that. Um, my wind chimes and my dream catchers are not letting things in to cause all these problems. Just my opinion. But I feel pretty confident about it. Generational curses. All kinds of things. Portals. Not wind chimes. No, not wind chimes. Not wind chimes. I got it mixed. You know, them windbreaker things. Oh, you know, them windbreaker things. No, Daisy, we don't know. What in the flying fuck is a windbreaker thing? Because I don't know. Not wind chimes. No, not wind chimes. Not wind chimes. I got it mixed. You know, them windbreaker things or wind things that people dream catchers. There you go. Those things are witchcraft. Excuse me? Excuse me. No, I understand everyone has a right to their opinion, but them when break or things, you know, an actual dream catcher. There's a lot of history behind a dream catcher. I've had them my entire life, ever since I was a little kid, and I think they're pretty cool. I don't think it's cool for you to be forcing things like that down people's throats. You know, like religion and politics and telling people that who have wind chimes and uh, dream catchers and things of that sort of nature that they're going to hell because they have them. Daisy, I believe that is wrong. And I do believe you probably have a lot of subscribers that also have these things who enjoy them. And what it seems to me like you're doing is insulting other people's religions and spiritual beliefs. And yeah, it probably won't go over too well, that's all. Life is not Daisy's way or the highway. Life is not even the Bible or the highway. It's whatever people want to do for themselves, however they feel, whatever they want to do spiritually or religiously or politically. <sighs> but we have Daisy here cramming this down our throats and telling us that we're going to hell. When I was living in it every single day of our life, we are living in a spiritual, supernatural world, whether we want to believe it or not. It's very, very real. Not wind chimes, you know, what do you call that? Dream catchers. Not wind chimes, dream catchers. Because you think that the, tr you dream, you, dr okay, dream catchers is supposed to take away your bad dreams. No, God, Jesus Christ is the only one that can do that. Well, Daisy Doodle, that's your opinion. So maybe you should say, in my opinion, or the way I look at things, or I follow the Bible and, you know, start with something like that because you're insulting people and their spiritual beliefs. That's why it is not good. Come up, Sailor. I need some help because people think, you know, if you want to come up, I'm just speaking the truth here and the truth will set you free. Yeah, I kind of feel like you need some help right now because you're digging yourself a hole. Unfortunately for you, 
you are spreading something that is your opinion, which is fine, you can have your opinion, but you're spreading it like it is the only thing in the world and everyone else is wrong. But you have to realize you have subscribers who are probably into dream catchers and other things. And those people have their own beliefs. And guess what? They're not going to hell. And just because I have a dream catcher doesn't mean I'm inviting demons in my house or into my life at all. Perhaps you need a history lesson about the dream catcher. And I thought, I thought about doing that, but I don't feel like I want to shove any spiritual ideas or religion down anyone's throat. So besides just the little blurb above there that I just got from Google, what I'll do is put some links in the description about the dream catcher, the history of the dream catcher, why it's important, and where it originates. Why not? All right, back to Daisy Doodle. We'll go to prayer garden and watch it. Since it's my, mm, mm, I'm trying to keep from cussing up here. It is Thanksgiving and I'm trying to keep from cussing, but it's very hard. I'm gonna give prayer garden a big strike too, honey. You watch, I'm striking her ass for using my content. But Daisy, then why is it okay for you to use other people's content? That doesn't really make sense now, does it? I'm not playing. I'm not playing for, with her. She's stealing my content. Hang on, let me let me uh, bring this up. Literally using my stuff to twist her damn agenda. Let me pull it up here because it's it's a it's a damn shame. She played what you said. So how did she? Well, how did she? Because she twisted what I said. She didn't play everything that I said. If she would watch, she would know that we cover Kingstington, Pennsylvania over here. There is a lot of dirty stuff that goes on in Kingstington. So don't come in here with your bullshit. Why does she have to play my stuff and twist it all around? I don't get it. She's freaking obsessed with me or something. She's, I don't know what her problem is. And then she keeps on playing the stolen content of me and Brandy talking. Daisy Doodle, it's not stolen. And that's because it was public. You had it running on your channel. Rap got it and played it on his channel, which was even more public. So there you have it. You're going to have to deal with it. And that makes it fair use for anybody, as long as they are transforming it. It's transformative. I also used it, or stole it, using your words. But anyway, it's not stolen. It's fair use. Deal with it. She just keeps right on. I mean, give it a damn break. Oh, wait, she probably freaking, uh, she probably uh, deleted it. We'll go to prayer garden and watch it. Since it's my, mm -mm, I'm trying to keep from cussing up here. It is Thanksgiving, and I'm trying to keep from cussing, but... It's bad too, honey. You watch. I'm striking her ass for using my content. I'm not playing. I'm not playing for, with her. She's stealing my content. Content. Hang on. Let me let me uh, bring this up. I'm not gonna cuss because it's Thanksgiving, and these devils just don't know how to stop. Listen, and that people. Video, she's um, right, will you turn on Lion King for OJ? Brooke. I down to the store, and there's a. I want to show y'all what they're playing of mine. Over there, playing it and twisting it around. I don't know. Probably on Meth Island. Doing. But I think he would have noticed. I don't know, but that's just me. It's always someone else. Let me tell you so something. I would do a whole show about you something, Ava. It ain't about sharing content. When you steal somebody else's content, you steal somebody else's content and you use it to weaponize and, and uh, talk shit about that creator and to twist lies and turn turn lies around. Daisy, it's really hard to twist it when it's your own words and then their opinions on top of that. It's still your words though. You're saying the words. You are acting like a lunatic at times. And that's just my opinion. I guess I'm twisting it. You are not doing what you're supposed to do. I've told Brooke not to steal my stuff. The stuff she stole was put in private. She got that. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something, Brooke. Keep on and you will end up in court. I'm not playing with her. Because I know, I happen to know that she's in with these little uh, people that uh, has harassed me and, and terrorized me. She was the first one who stole my content. The very first one who stole it from the person who took it in my back chat. I could really give you a huge lecture here about fair use and how it actually works. 
but Daisy, it's your responsibility to go read the terms of service that YouTube puts out for all of us to read. Go have a look. If you want to waste your money taking someone to court for fair use, that's on you. But good luck with that. You're going to lose. She took it and put it out on her channel. Daisy, you never really shut up about this. It's getting old. This is from like, I don't know, a couple months ago, a month ago, whatever. It's getting old. But let's have a listen. Breaker. But I did. And then she turned it around and tried to say that it was Brandy's content. No, that was my stolen live. It, that was stolen from me. Don't fuck with the stolen content, guys. Don't fuck with it. It was stolen. You know it's hard out here for a bill. Yeah, tastes like magic. Like, get your own damn content. Got to have it. Tastes like magic. You're literally stealing my content. I mean, you're literally stealing my content. No, that was my stolen live. It, that was stolen from me. It was stolen. Get your own damn content. Get your own damn content. You know it's hard out here for a 